Hello! In our last video, we showed you how to create your first entry in Catalogit. In this case, it was this acorn mosh bowl. Now we're going to show you how to edit an entry. So again, you've logged into your Catalogit account, you're seeing your entry here, and you click on your entry to bring up the entry. So there it is. We have the one picture, and all that we put it, all that's in there is the date that it was created. We want to add some additional information at this time. So you click on your pencil up here in the upper left corner. Pencil opens up fields for editing. So click on the pencil, it opens up all these fields. Now let's see, the first thing I'd like to do is actually add some other pictures. I know in my files I have more pictures of this particular item, so I'm going to click on the little camera here. Again, if you were on your smartphone or tablet, you'd also be able to take pictures directly from that device and add them to the file. So in this case, I'm going to open my photos. Let's see here, I've got some additional pictures of this. You can select multiple, multiple pictures at the same time. I've selected these three photos here. I'm going to click this open and they're uploading here into the file. And at the same time, I'm going to start entering some more information here. Now let's see, I can describe the thing, the item here. This is a low wide bowl. And if I wanted to, I can go into further description about the type of design that's on here. That's up to you with how much information you want to put there. The ethnography, in this case, this is something that is from Northern California. And in this case, I'm going to guess that the tribe is Hoopa. Okay, if I knew who the artist was, I could enter that information here, who they were, when it was made approximately. I don't know that information, at least I'm not sure at this point, so I'm going to hold off on entering that. But I do know its dimensions. Well, it's, it is four inches high. Catalog, it assumes you're using inches, but you can change that if I wanted to, for instance, measure this instead and say that it was oh, 15 centimeters high. I could do that and it will accept the centimeters. But in this case, it's four inches and it is nine and a quarter inches in diameter. I can express that as either 9.25 or I can express it as nine dash one quarter. Okay, so anyway, you can see here, there's that. There's the information I've entered in so far. My other pictures are here. And I'm going to stop cataloging for now, maybe come back and work on this one a little later. So I'm going to click Save up here. It's saved. Now I have a little bit of a description. I have some of the ethnography captured, and I have the dimensions captured. I can go back to my main menu here, my All Entries, and there's my Acorn Mush Bowl again. 